The clarification on FAC's decision to step down some wax memos comes amidst growing concern about the fate of numerous infrastructure projects across the country. Wax Minister Engineer David Omahi pointed out that many of the projects, some of which date back several years, were initially budgeted at a cost that no longer reflects current market realities, hence the need for a review. And we saw uh, television, I personally saw that, that FAC had directed that all inherited projects be stepped down. That is very, very misleading and is capable of, uh, you know, causing a serious harm, you know, for our economy. Neither the president nor FEC directed that inherited projects should be stepped down. Rather, it was Mr. President, out of his magnanimity, and very exceptional, that directed that all inherited projects should be made alive. Through appropriation. According to the minister, some projects have faced delays due to various challenges. Therefore, the review will also consider the timeline and current state of each project assigned to each contractors. What we are doing now is to review the project in line with availability of funds and make proposal to FEC. If such a project has attained about 80% completion, they will make a proposal to FEC that in subsequent appropriation, money should be, you know, made available and such projects should be made a priority. Engineer David Omayi called for patience and cooperation from contractors, stakeholders and all parties involved. He assured them that the ultimate goal is to deliver quality infrastructure that meets the needs of Nigerians as the review process is aimed at optimizing resource allocation and maximizing the impact of these projects. Susan Ita, ITV News.